sub subscribe aim aim i and get the latest technological updates every day also press this bell icon so you won't miss any of my latest videos Imagine if you have two fans facing each other. Turn one fan on and it will blow air over the blades of the other fan and causes the other fan to spin. But if, if you hold the second fan still, the first fan will keep right on spinning. So guys, that's exactly how a torque converter works. So guys, that's our today's topic. So guys, welcome back to AIMI. We, we will keep learning the engineering topics and our today's topic is the how a torque converter works so guys the torque converter is an automatic transmission that serves the same purpose as that of the clutch in the manual transmission so in in a torque converter there is impeller we can call it as a first fan which is connected to the engine shaft the other fan is the turbine which is connected to the transmission input shaft so guys instead of using air the torque converter uses liquid medium which cannot be compressed that can be oil or otherwise transmission fluid the cars with the automatic transmission uses torque converter so guys let's check out the parts of a torque converter and the principle so guys there are the three components inside inside a very strong housing of a torque converter which works together to transmit power to the transmission the first one is the pump we can also call it as a impeller the second one is the turbine which which situated on the opposite side of the impeller and the last one is the stator which sits between the pump and the turbine so guys when the impeller spins the fluid is thrown outwards by the centrifugal force and it caused by the rotation of the impeller of the fluid the flow from the impeller is directed over the blades of the turbine so the turbine rotates the fluid from the turbine flows through the stator and back to the impeller so guys this uh, cycle goes on repeating continuously until the engine is running when the vehicle moves at very high speed the turbine has reached approximately 90% of the impeller speed the torque multiplication has created now the torque converter is simply a fluid coupling so uh, the impeller has curved blades and it is filled with the fluid the faster the impeller rotates the higher the centrifugal force the turbine is situated opposite to the impeller the turbine blades are installed in such a way that it allows the fluid to flow uh, the turbine blades are installed in such a way that it allows the fluid to flow to the inner part of the inner part of the turbine and then to the impeller the stator is necessary to convert the torque and it is interposed between the impeller and the turbine the curves on the stator is of uh, the 90 degrees guys we can see over here it is of 90 degrees which results in the multiplication of the torque so guys uh, uh, this is how a torque converter works and so this is how the torque converter works in the uh, IC engine so guys basically this uh, kind of the torque converter is used in the automatic transmission and the output of the torque converter is connected to the input of the automatic transmission so guys we have seen the working of the torque torque converter and the main parts of the torque converter so guys i hope you understand our video i hope you like our video so guys if i miss anything in this video please do comment and tell me what i have missed in this video please do hit like and share my videos to the social network so guys thank you for watching my video Please subscribe to my channel AMI.